Hello, there, kitties. I'm Curry, the vacuum tube witch. What would you expect? The vacuum tube? Again? This will be about the hair curler that uh, I use for making those Betty Bangs. The problem with, uh, with the thing is that uh, it's just too hot. And uh, let's take a closer look at uh, what's inside and whether we can uh, modify it um, so that it has uh, a little bit uh, less power because I've got the idea how to do it. And I will um, explain um, how exactly it is gonna work. To the bench! So get this curler right here and let me take the screwdriver to get inside. That's just two screws, pretty easy. This is a uh, Philips uh, curler. The name is Salon Curl Essential. The model number is HP4657. Taking it apart. We can see the, um, the heater inside this metal tube. We can see the printed circuit board, and we can see quite a uh, clever coupler that uh, allows uh, rotating the power cord uh, without uh, it uh, becoming twisted. Works uh, just like the commutator on a uh, electric motor. Let's take a look at uh, how this printed circuit board uh, looks on the other side. Because uh, in order to do the modification, I will still have to take it uh, apart. Come on. All we have on the board is um, just a single pole double throw switch, a resistor, an LED, and a rectifier diode. That's all it takes. The power from the mains wire comes on the switch. After the switch it goes to the heater, goes back uh, and to the neutral wire. And uh, parallel to the heater there is uh, a branch um, of um, the rectifier diode, um, the LED and the resistor. The resistor is uh, 150 kilo ohms. It's very simple. About as simple as it gets. And now I am wondering if I could um, do a little modification in order to decrease the power of the device because uh, it gets too hot when I use it, it burns my skin. I, uh, I don't want that, so if I can 
decreased the power so that uh, I got uh, half of the power rather than uh, full power. It's gonna be quite nice. And uh, all it takes is this teeny tiny 1N4007 diode. And I will try um, putting it uh, in line with, uh, with the heater. Let's leave the main switch uh, at its uh, original function. Looking for the way to do it. I'll probably... Just uh, this other one of the wires and uh, connect the diode with it. Here it comes. Checking if it matches mechanically. It should be perfect. This other one end of the diode uh, to the PCB. Remembering about um, the slider for the switch. Putting the PCB back in its uh, proper place. Those teeny tiny screws. Careful not to over tighten those. And the last thing I will do is replacing this red wire with um, one of um, the leads uh, from the diode. Reflowing the solder because it doesn't look uh, all that well. And it's time to put the thing together.
second time to test it. Wondering how hot it will get. And uh, when it is heating, I can explain what I just did. See, a curler is just a heating element. Basically, a resistor. This is the main switch, and this would be the LED branch. So this would be the original circuit of, um, of the curler. And what I did was just adding a rectifier diode and uh, how it works is that uh, if you have uh, the AC powered uh, heater, the voltage uh, across it uh, changes over time uh, it's just a sine wave. And the power is basically the integrated... Uh, it's, uh, it's basically the integrated uh, voltage times current uh, over time. In, in other words, uh, it would be the, the area under the graph, uh, both for the positive and uh, negative uh, parts of the sine wave. It would be the sum. And uh, if we have a uh, half-wave uh, rectifier, then uh, it only passes current through. It only passes current uh, when uh, it flows uh, in the direction of the diode. It blocks uh, the other half, uh, so uh, this would be passing only the positive parts, uh, leaving out the negative. And uh, we can clearly see that uh, the surface area under the graph uh, would be half of what we would get uh, on the on the sine wave. So uh, by doing this, uh, it just means that uh, we put uh, half of the power across the heating element. Plain and simple and very easy to do.